Prospective buyers for Bombardier's new Global 7000 long-range business jet are going to have to wait two years longer than expected, with the manufacturer having announced in late July that the aircraft will not enter service until mid-2018. The Global 7000 is Bombardier's response to the rival Gulfstream G650. It promises a maximum range of 7,300 nautical miles at Mach 0.85 with 10 passengers and 4 crew, while the G650 flies 7,500 nautical miles, but with two fewer passengers. For long intercontinental flights, cabin comfort is especially important. We asked Bombardier to give us a tour of the mock-up and point out what the company considers to be some of the model's key selling points. So this is the first zone of the cabin. The Global 7000 has four dedicated living spaces. Uh, we like to think of this as more of our social area and work area in the first two zones. Our pull-out tables come out from the side instead of the top, so you can see that actually all of this real estate on the top here is never interrupted by the mechanism of the table opening and closing, so you can always have your glasses and anything else here and it's not gonna be interrupted. So this is our conference grouping, and we find that sitting in this area is very, very comfortable for you know, anywhere from two to six people to have a very social environment. We have a table leaf that will drop in the middle, and these two middle seats will track to the center line, and you've got six place dining with lots of elbow room for everybody. So this is our third zone, is what we like to think of as more of an entertainment zone. As you go farther back in the cabin, you go from more the public uh, social area workspace to a more private stateroom atmosphere for the principal on the aircraft or his family. Uh, very comfortable, cozy space for entertaining, relaxing. A brand new divan design with, again, a lot more focus on ergonomics and comfort. The seat pan in the back will actually uh, track slightly to give you a little bit more of a recline on a long flight uh, that can be a big difference when you're sitting on this uh, as opposed to maybe one of our comfortable lounge chairs in the front but again very uh, very much a focus on a home-like experience we put uh, really nice finishes on the walls here uh, for listening to movies it's a lot more cozy than say some uh, hard finishes like veneers and things like that and here, lastly, our uh, final zone is the stateroom. This is people's home in the skies, really, when you think about it. Very unique in this size of an aircraft, and the length of the Global 7000 really affords customers the ability to create a zone like this without dedicated seats for takeoff and landing. Uh, because you have that extra space, you can put a permanent bed on this aircraft and not lose the seating capacity that you would have with another aircraft like a Global 6000. Little details like these lights and a table lamp over on the credenza here just makes it really feel that much more homey. So the final stop here is at our aft lavatory. It's been completely redesigned again with home-like finishes and details. You can see we have stone flooring here which will be available on our aircraft. Completely redesigned cabinets here. This bathroom can be completely reconfigured as well to put a full height shower in here. The shower is actually at the center line of the aircraft. So if you're six feet tall, you can still be standing up and taking a full shower. There's a, a rainfall shower head that's right in the, the headliner of the aircraft. The neat thing about that as well is even with the shower in here, you have a door on the back end of the shower and you can still access your baggage compartment, which on our global aircraft, you can access at all times in, in flight. First deliveries of the Global 7000 should be in the second half of 2018. A year later, Bombardier aims to introduce the Global 8000 model, which is 9 feet shorter but will have even more range at 7,900 nautical miles. You can read much more about the Global 7000 and 8000 in the October-November 2015 issue of Business Jet Traveler or at BJT Online.